Please subscribe to my channel, Audio Novels. See playlist for other chapters and novels. Thank you. Chapter 322, Yama's Invitation Kyo Yuhao knew that Long Utn was much stronger than him, but that he still had a fighting chance. After fighting Long Utn, he had gained a deeper understanding of his abilities. If he could regain his mobility and absorb all the origin energy of Ultimate Ice in his body, his cultivation would reach the level of a Soul Emperor. When that happened, he was confident of challenging Long Elton through his various fighting methods. Wang Donga pushed Huo Yu Hao off the stage and immediately stood behind him to massage his shoulders. Huo Yu Hao also had a milk bottle in his hand, and started to recover his soul power. Even though he had lost this fight, the Tang sect still held the advantage. Among the three who had competed from the Snowdenman sect, Chen Lu was definitely unable to compete in the team round. This meant that they were already a man down for the team round. Xisanshai stood up. It was the first time he was so serious in this tournament. The strength of his opponent also motivated his own fighting will. Second competing member from the Tang sect, please come up to the stage. Zheng Zan seemed to be a little lost after witnessing such an exciting fight. However, he still continued to manage the proceedings of this individual elimination round. Xisanshai was about to walk up to the stage, but he heard a voice calling, wait a minute. He was a little puzzled as he stopped. He turned to Jiang Nanan beside him. Jiang Nanan stood up and looked at him with a passionate gaze. She said softly, return safely. As she spoke, she hugged Xu Sanshai's neck in front of everyone before pecking him on the cheek. Xu Sanshai was stunned. Xia Xia was the shyest among the three ladies of the Shrek's seven monsters. However, Jiang Nanan was the most conservative. He was lucky when she was willing to hold his hand. Even if he pestered her for a month, he might not even be able to kiss her. However, Jiang Nanan now took the initiative to kiss him in front of everyone. Furthermore, she wasn't encouraging him to win. She had asked him to return safely. It was just a simple few words. However, Xu Sanshai's blood surged. He hugged Jiang Nanan tightly and let out a loud whistle. He stomped his right foot on the ground and jumped up onto the stage. He was too excited. He was even blushing slightly. His entire aura also seemed a little unstable. However, this instability made him seem like a volcano that was about to erupt. He was under great pressure. He took big steps forward and came to the center of the stage. He nodded at the referee. In the Tang sect's waiting area, Bu gave Jiang Nanan a thumbs up. Everyone from the Tang sect knew that Jiang Nanan was the greatest motivation for Xu Sanshai. Jiang Nanan was his greatest weakness, but she was also a catalyst to him. Xia Xiao laughed. She copied Jiang Nanan's gentle voice and said, return safely. Jiang Nanan blushed. I hope that everyone can return safely. Teased, then you should give me a kiss when I compete later and tell me to return safely. All right. Jiang Nanan snapped. Keep dreaming. Xiao Ya is watching. Psst expression turned stiff. He laughed bitterly and shook his head. Jiang Nanan appeared very apologetic after she said that, and hurriedly said, Sorry, I. Pst smiled and said, No worries, I'll make sure Xiao Ya returns safely as well. As he said this, there was a strong sense of belief that came from him. However, everyone could feel how desperate he was. P turned to Huo Yu Hao and softly asked, Yu Hao, what is his martial soul? Kyo Yu Hao replied, his martial soul should be his skin. It's very rare among body souls. I communicated this to second senior earlier. Furrowed his brow. Does that mean that he has no flaws? Kyo Yu Hao answered, he is really strong. He must have invented his own fighting skill, and even has a very deep comprehension of it. His cultivation has even reached the realm of the unity of heaven and man. To him, soul skills won't make a big difference. 
His body is his strongest soul skill. He's very scary. After he finished saying this, he shut his eyes and continued to replenish his soul power. In his mind, scenes of his fight with Long Uten also replayed continuously, especially the last clash between them. Ancestor Tang San, I'm sorry. I wasn't able to carry on the Tang sect's reputation of having the best, top ranked hidden weapons on the continent. However, I only used half of the power of that ultimate technique. He would have died if it were paired with lethal poison. If Yama tells someone to die, no one will dare to delay. This ultimate technique was ranked third among the three great hidden weapon techniques of the Tang sect that Tang San left in the poison scripture, Yama's Invitation. Yama's Invitation, a hidden weapon that could chase one's soul and seize it forcibly. Kuo Yu Hao had used his self-invented Goddess of Light's fighting technique to imitate Yama's invitation. This had depleted all his remaining soul power. Otherwise, he wouldn't have conceded defeat. Long Uten was too strong. There was no way he could have weakened him without using such a method. Long Uten was a seven-ringed soul sage who could exhibit a martial soul true body. If everyone from the Tang sect only competed based on their order, they might have to pay a huge price even if they could defeat him. If that happened, what would they do in the team round later on? This was why Huo Yu Hao had sacrificed all his soul power to use the Yama's invitation. Although Long Elton managed to resist his attack, he was still eventually hurt. Furthermore, Huo Yu Hao could also confirm that he was hurt quite badly. Yama's invitation had two deadly ways to kill its target. The first was lethal poison. Kuo Yu Hao hadn't had time to research the poison chapter that Tang San left behind in depth. As a result, he couldn't recreate the true Yama's invitation. That was why he couldn't truly utilize this deadly technique. This was why he said he'd only exhibited a part of Yama's invitation. The second one was the actual Yama's invitation. There was a special technique to unleash it. It fused the controlling crane, capturing dragon, purple demon eyes, mysterious heaven technique, mysterious jade hands and many other abilities. It also greatly depleted one's soul power. Furthermore, it didn't matter what rank a soul master was in, the depletion would be equally great. It was just that the strength of Yama's invitation would increase depending on one's cultivation. The actual Yama's invitation couldn't be avoided. Once it entered the opponent's body, it would immediately be crushed before it coursed through it at a frightening speed. Even without any lethal poison, it was still very terrifying. Otherwise, it wouldn't be among the Tang sect's hidden weapon hundred separation, and even be the third ranked throwing type hidden weapon. Kuo Yu Hao had unleashed the second effect of Yama's invitation earlier. Long Uten had used the strength of his body soul, which had undergone its second awakening, to reduce the majority of the impact force from Huo Yu Hao's partial Yama's invitation. He had also dispelled the part of Yama's invitation that was formed using Huo Yu Hao's spiritual and soul power. However, the crushed Yama's invitation still gave him great trouble after it entered his body. When he spat out that mouthful of blood, he had used his soul power and control over his body to force the Yama's invitation out of his body. However, Yama's invitation was very strong. Even though he had forced it out of his body, his passageways were still bound to be hurt. They weren't lightly hurt either. Right now, the next fight on the stage had already begun. As the referee signaled the start of the fight, Xu Sanshai immediately unleashed his shield of the Xuan Wu turtle and charged towards his opponent. Right now, he was very energetic, and his aura was pressing. His eyes appeared very sharp. There was only one thought in his mind. If I perform well, will Nanan give me further rewards? In the waiting area, Jiang Nanan was a little worried as she saw Xu Sanshai charging towards his opponent. She asked, Will he be fine? smiled and answered her, why? Don't you trust his abilities? While his opponent is strong, he is adept at defending. This is the best kind of fight for him. If it were me, I wouldn't do any better than him. 
especially after your encouragement earlier, I believe he'll be able to unleash his full abilities. Don't worry. When this guy is serious, he can be no better than anyone. Okay. Jiang Nanan nodded gently. She focused on the two on the stage, who were getting closer and closer to each other. Long Uten acted as if nothing had happened in his previous fight against Huo Yu Hao. He continued to slide forward as usual. The feeling of the unity of heaven and man appeared once again. Xisan Shai felt the pressure that Huo Yu Hao had felt earlier. His opponent's omnipresent and integrative aura was very uncomfortable. However, Xu Sanshai wouldn't fight his opponent using fighting techniques. They weren't what he was good at. He placed his shield in front of him to protect himself. They were about to clash. Long Uten wasn't the one who made the first move. Instead, it was Xu Sanshai. When Long Uten was ten meters away from him, he stomped on the ground with his right leg and stopped himself in his tracks. His third soul ring shone, and his shield surged with black light. His aura instantly became very cold and eerie. As he pushed his shield forward, his first soul ring shone slightly after his third soul ring. Layers of black light started to surge outward. These lights were like bubbles that rushed towards Long Uten like overlapping waves. Xisanshai's third soul skill, Mysterious Underworld Force, and his first soul skill, Mysterious Underworld Quake. When he used the mysterious underworld quake this time, it didn't provide him all around control and defense. Instead, it was focused in one direction. As he unleashed it with all his strength, the layers of black light resisted the pressure that Long Elton brought to him. This was Xisanshai's true ability. He was one of the Gemini from Shrek Academy in the past. Even Shrek's seven monsters had never seen him go all out before. Long Uten snorted and swept his right hand upward. A white blade formed out of thin air. Suddenly, the black bubbles were crushed as they encountered the blade. Xisanshai's quaking force was unable to reach Long Uten. However, Long Uten was stalled as he was attacked. After the white blade of air got close to Xisanshai's shield, it was eventually dissipated by the mysterious underworld quake. Long Uten lifted his right arm and mimicked a pressing action towards Xisanshai with his palm. Suddenly, a white, palm-shaped glow spread. This palm-shaped glow completely stopped the mysterious underworld quake that had reformed after it was destroyed. In addition, it also forced its way closer to Xisanshai. Black and white were clearly separated. Long Uten's attack seemed unstoppable and quickly arrived in front of the Xisanshai's shield. Boom! The white palm-shaped glow scattered. Amidst the tremendous boom, Xisanshai retreated. He staggered backward, and his footsteps seemed a little messy. Long Uten was unforgiving. He stepped forward with his left leg and formed a fist before striking again. This time, it was a fist-shaped glow which seemed even stronger. The glow which was more than a meter in diameter, quickly reached the staggering Xu Sanshai. Xu Sanshai's shield tilted slightly to one side. Under the effect of the mysterious underworld force, the surface of the shield shone with layers of pitch black light. Boom, another loud boom sounded. Xu Sanshai retreated seven to eight steps this time. He even lifted his shield as it was jerked to one side. Long Uten attacked with his right fist. Xisanshai did something unexpected this time. He squatted down and tilted his shield upward. Bang! When the fist-shaped glow scattered, a huge patch of white light could be seen above Xisanshai. However, he rolled over from this fist. His shield seemed to grow on his body. Even when he rolled, the shield still protected him. He rolled for several dozen meters before he managed to get up, and when he stood up, he still retreated a few steps. After three consecutive strikes, Xu Sanshai appeared very disheveled. However, Long Uten squinted his eyes and smiled. He said, Good. Xu Sanshai held his shield in front of him and groaned, I don't need you to tell me that I'm good. Come on. As he said, he hooked his left hand to bait Long Uten to attack him. 
Longerton didn't make a sound. He pointed his left foot toward the ground. This time, he reached maximum speed. His body flashed before he was immediately in front of Xasenshai. As he unleashed his palms, intense white light seemed to turn his entire body into a burning white color. Boom, the shield of the Xuanwu turtle was crushed. Xasenshai groaned as he was pushed back. However, it was only the first layer of the shield that was crushed. After the first layer was crushed, Longerton's strength destroyed the second layer, followed by the third layer. In front of Xasenshai, his shield seemed to turn into countless layers. Furthermore, he was also retreating continuously. Please subscribe to my channel, Audio Novels. See playlist for other chapters and novels. Thank you.